In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can easily create a fully managed AI agent and also create a customer support chatbot and embed it directly into your website in just a few clicks. And I'm gonna be using DigitalOcean for this tutorial because they have access to the best models out there and it's token-based billing, so you only pay for what you use. And if you click the link down below, you'll actually get a $200 free trial. Let's go ahead and get started. Once you've created an account with DigitalOcean, it will bring you into this dashboard and we can go ahead and click the green create button at the top of the screen. And then we're gonna go ahead and click agents. And now we are at the create an agent interface. So we are gonna go ahead and name our agent. I'm gonna name it restaurant. And then we're gonna scroll down to this custom configuration box. And we're gonna put in our agent instructions. It's best to make this as specific as possible. You can ask ChatGPT to help you out. I'm gonna go ahead and put act as a restaurant that does delivery. This is very simple. I just wanna show you guys how it works. And then we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna go ahead and select the model. I'm gonna go ahead and use the default Llama 3.3 model. However, feel free to use any model that you would like. And then we're gonna scroll down and it says add knowledge base. We haven't added a knowledge base yet. I'll show you how to do that in the very next step. And then you can go ahead and select which project you want it added to. This is basically right here. You can group your projects on the sidebar menu. You can just keep it as the default. And then we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna go ahead and click the create agent button. This will take a few minutes to create. And once it's finished creating, this banner will disappear at the top. And while the agent's being created, we're gonna go ahead and create our knowledge base. So we're gonna click this link right here, back to Gen AI platform. And then we're gonna click the knowledge bases tab, and it's gonna go ahead and open up this. And we're gonna go ahead and click create knowledge base. And then you can put in a knowledge base name. So I will go ahead and type food menu. And then I'm gonna go ahead and click select data source. And this is very cool. You can upload a space, which basically has a bunch of data on DigitalOcean or a folder. You can also click URL for web crawling and you can put in a single URL or you can click right here, URL and all linked pages and path, or you can even have it crawl all the subdomains. I'm gonna go ahead and click the file upload option and we're gonna go ahead and upload a file. This is the file I'm gonna upload. It's basically a simple Italian menu. It has some pizza, it has some pasta items as well as some drinks. You can see I've uploaded my PDF menu and now I'm gonna go ahead and click add selected data source. It's now uploading the PDF file and it says it's ready. And then we're gonna scroll down. I'm gonna leave this data center as is. And then we're gonna scroll down. We're just gonna keep everything on the default settings. And we're gonna go ahead and click create knowledge base. And you can see right here on our knowledge bases tab where it says last indexed, not indexed yet. We're gonna have to wait for the data to index and then we'll be able to add it to our AI agent. If you're uploading just a simple PDF, it's pretty fast. If you're uploading a lot of data or doing a lot of web scraping, it may take a little bit. All right, now that our knowledge base has been indexed, we're gonna go ahead back to agents and then we're gonna go ahead and click our restaurant agent that we just created. And we're gonna scroll down where it says attach knowledge base and we're gonna go ahead and click it. And now you can see our pizza menu knowledge base is right here. You can also add multiple knowledge bases. We're gonna just add one for this tutorial and we're gonna go ahead and press save. Now we have this test in the playground button right here where we can go ahead and test our agent out. It's gonna go ahead and open up what looks like a support chat bot. So we're gonna ask the AI agent, how much is the marinara pizza and see what it says. It says the marinara pizza is $10. If we go back and look at our menu, you can see that's correct. And then I'm gonna say, I want five of them for delivery. And it says the total comes out to $50, which is correct. And then it's asking us for a delivery address and phone number. And then I've told it my address and also my phone number. And it says, we'll send a confirmation text once your order is on the way. And it says, would you like to pay by card or cash upon delivery? I'm gonna tell them I will pay in cash. 
and boom, you can see everything was successful. So now I'm gonna show you how you can embed this into your site. So we're gonna go back to Gen AI platform, the link right here, and then we're gonna go ahead and click our restaurant agent. And you can see it has a step four. This is where you can add guardrails, function routing, agent routes. I'm gonna skip that. I think our bot works fine for now. So we're gonna click skip step and then it says manage endpoint we're going to go ahead and click that and we want to embed this chatbot on our website so we're going to have to select public and go ahead and save now if we scroll down we're going to go ahead and see this now and this is a script tag that you can literally copy and paste into your website and you will have that chatbot in your website if we go ahead and click preview we can see how it looks and this is how it looks. You may want to theme it to your website. So you can go ahead and click customize and you can set the primary color, the secondary color, the button background color and the starting message. And you can upload a logo. And if we scroll down, we can see some insights. We can also see some token metric data. And if we scroll up, we can actually see how much we've been charged so far. And it's just one penny so far to deploy everything and test it out. So overall, I think the Gen AI platform that DigitalOcean has released is an absolute game changer. Anyone can create an AI agent in just minutes. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day.